hello plant lovers we're currently looking at a very overgrown area there's a lot going on in this area we've got the uh, dahlia there we've got my pepper raised bed here you can see lots of cute um confetti peppers there are many peppers and there we can see some paprika peppers hopefully you can see them um and I've also got some tomato plants in the back. There, hopefully, you can see tomatoes. There are some ripe ones. Just there and there. Okay, but the big problem at the moment is the grapevine. It's overgrown the trellis. It's going across the fence, but in a really weird way. It's going over to the neighbours. So we're going to try and build a structure, me and my dad, to see what we can do to help the grapevine because um, if it doesn't have like a really good space to grow, it's, it's, we're not going to get grapes next year basically. This is its second year and this is Lakemont Seedless and I really need to figure out what to do here. So we're going to build a structure to hopefully help organise the grapevine. Okay, let's get started. So here's an example of some of the scrap wood we will be using. Uh, these are just uh, pieces of scrap wood that my dad would have found, um, you know, while he goes on his walks. He always loves to reclaim <laughs> scrap wood that has been thrown out. Um, yeah, so free wood to do this project. Okay, so um, here my dad is starting the frame. We're basically just extending the existing trellis that is hidden behind the grapevine. Um, and there you can see we've got the outline. Then we put the kind of inside bits in. I'm not sure what they're called. Then we put the long bars across and that gives the trellis a lot of stability um, and it makes it easier to train the grapevines along it. We actually were going to make a much more sophisticated structure, but I think for this season we decided that what we're doing now would be enough. And as you can see, it's coming together um, and it's given us like what a good, maybe less than a meter height. But it's all tangled, so we'll, we'll put this one like this. So as you can see there, I'm just trying to untangle the grapevine. It was absolutely tangled up and it was, uh, you know, really congested. So I managed to open it out and attach it onto the trellis. Okay, so it still looks really messy, but what I've done is I have um, kind of pointed some of the grapevines up into, uh, up onto the trellis. Uh, so I've redirected them. Obviously, they've only just been redirected, so they're they're not facing, they're not looking great right now. But they will do once it's all done. So those now have been redirected this way. So at least they should grow across the trellis. Then they should start to face the light and look much more neat and tidy and better. Anyway, that's it from me. I hope you enjoyed uh, this trellis, DIY trellis video. And as always, take care until next time.